Vision Summit. The summit was strongly wanted and supported by IES, Italian Association of Instrumentation, for which I am honored to be I, Claudio Montresor, the president. The same pride should be extended to Mr. Hugo Baggi, president of ISA Italy Session. Why was the event so strongly wanted? Because it has been ages since a similar event was organized in Italy. In Italy, we have more than 3 million small companies. That's the fact. The, the highest number of the comes from small companies. And I think um, in the past, Italy showed with their innocence, with many other uh, periods of the, this history, that we are able to invest, to create, uh, to provide solutions. Uh, so we have to get together. And these two associations, sono Silvia Levi e lavoro come assistente marketing per, per la Baggi, ma ultimamente in quest'ultimo mese mi sono occupata di collaborare con l'associazione ISISA, ci sono due associazioni di strumentisti, una italiana e una internazionale. Non potevamo che non essere qua a collaborare e rappresentare un po' questo bellissimo evento per noi. I'm so honored and excited to participate in International uh, Summit of Automation and Instrumentation that is very much supported by uh, ESA corporate partners and leading companies. That is a great opportunity uh, for me to participate here to meet all these technology professionals who are providing a cutting edge solution for the challenge of the automation and future work. Uh, nowadays, uh, automation is uh, playing a very vital role. More developed countries are uh, investing a lot in this section and I'm so happy that I am part of this uh, large uh, family. Hello, my name is David O'Brien. I'm the District Vice President for District 12 for the ISA, the International Society of Automation. We have here behind me uh, the ISA stand at the AIS-ISA Joint Exhibition and Automation Conference. Uh, we're in fabulous surroundings and uh, we welcome everybody here today and we'd like to thank the participation of all of our exhibitors and our speakers and also all our sponsors. is uh, consists of Europe, Middle East, Africa and Russia. Um, the ISA activities are responsible for things like standards development, training, publications um, and in particular note on standards relate to cyber security, safety instrument systems, alarm management and um, we have had uh, great attendance at the, at the exhibitions We've also had uh, training events earlier on this week, on Monday and Tuesday. And on Friday and Saturday, the District 12 sections uh, from Europe, Middle East, Africa have an opportunity to host our AGM, which will be held in Milano. Hello, uh, I'm Francisco Diaz uh, Andreu from ISA Spain and uh, I will be talking about the uh, student sections. Student sections is uh, something that is organized by students and uh, who are interested in automation and uh, who are interested in a close contact with industry. That's the two key, key points. What are they doing normally? They, they organize conferences, they organize uh, training courses, they organize uh, uh, practices, labs, there are more than 100 uh, ISA uh, student sections uh, all over the world and uh, we hope that uh, we can have uh, soon uh, an Italian student section. I'm a student and uh, this uh, for us uh, is a, a real opportunity. Uh, we can deal with the world of automation. Our goal is to 
share our ideas so that we can build our future. ISA is an international organization and so we are not alone. Uh, there are a lot of uh, student section all over the world and uh, an important student section is the one from Spain. In fact, tomorrow will be the opportunity to speak with them uh, during the DLC. to make that training.